Okay, LFD research here. Today we're taking a look at two different bolt carrier groups. We have a normal weight and a lightweight. Now, of course, both of these are non-standard coatings. We have uh, titanium nitride and uh, nickel boron. But what we wanted to do is see how much of a timing differential we're looking at. We've tried this test a few times. The one that we finally were successful to actually get a visible difference that was repeatable. We had to push the camera up to 11,000 frames per second. Previous times we were doing about 1,500 frames per second and you really couldn't see a difference 100% of the time. Up here at 11,000 we can see the difference. Now we will give you all four of the shots here. Now to give you an idea of how we did this testing, what we did is we used the same gun with the different bolt carriers, the only changes, and we used some 77 grain IMI razor core ammunition to test this. Same lot of ammo for the entire test. That should give us as close to the same amount of gas going through the system every single time as is possible. Now, you will notice here that definitely the lightweight opens faster. The interesting thing is you have far less bounce on close with a lightweight bolt than the standard weight. Now the recoil spring and buffer in this is a Geisley Super 42, but we're still looking at huge amounts of bolt bounce on the standard weight. The surprising thing I find is how long it takes at the end for that to lock up again. You may think, oh no, there's nothing changing, but if you look real close up in the corner, of the standard weight bolt carrier, you'll notice it cam back a little bit and then cam forward again. Keep an eye on that, but just thought you might want to see what kind of differential you're looking at between the two. The real downside on the lightweight bolt carrier group is you'll notice on this one, it's actually got a little cutout, so if your dust cover is open, you have an ingress path for dirt right into the action of your gun. Otherwise, it looks pretty good, and I've had great success running it for last thousand plus rounds. If you like this kind of content, support us on Patreon, like and comment on the video if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.